Do you have something that you truly, relentlessly desire? Despite your state of mind, is there something else that you would go completely to the end of the world to get? Well, lucky for you, there's a way to achieve what you're looking for, and you won't need to go to the end of the world to get it, but you will need to go somewhere, and the place may be too out of reach for some. It's not far away, closer than one may believe, but there are requirements that some individuals may not meet. First, whatever it is that you seek, know that you must seriously desire what you want. In your eyes, it should be something you need. If you begin the journey without the correct state of mind, you'll surely fail, as it will be near impossible to turn back once the journey starts. The second requirement is that you will need a vehicle of sorts. Some use a car, as it's the most comfortable choice. There have been a select few that have used small motorized vehicles, such as an ATV or motorcycle, but this has proven to be quite difficult, as the conditions of the journey can prove to be too bothersome. Do not use a vehicle too large or noticeable, as you will need some of the cover of night to be most safe. Also, while any sort of car will do, you may not want to choose the most expensive or cherished vehicle. You could take your slick new black Mercedes for the drive if you'd like, but don't expect it to come out in a pristine state. Make sure your vehicle is completely fueled before beginning the drive. The first task to accomplish is to locate the road. It doesn't have a name, it's not on the map, and technically, it doesn't even exist. It will only show up if you're looking for it at the right time, and you will only spot it if you know what you're looking for. Finally, you must be alone during the journey. You didn't think you'd be able to go with a group, did you? It must be night when you begin. Choose the time of night where you believe the roads are the least populated. Drive to any area that is just a stretch of road surrounded by woods. Here's where you want to start paying close attention. If you're looking for the road, it will turn up eventually, but you need to search for the road's hint in order to pull down the right one. Once you're close, you'll see or feel its signs. What the signs will be will depend on what it is you desire. For example, if you search for wealth, you may spot shimmers on the empty branches of trees, as if they resembled the shine of gold or diamonds. If you seek love, you may begin to see rose petals slowly dance on the light breeze, blowing in the road's direction. If you seek revenge, you might sense an ever-growing feel of heat or anger in your body as you approach. Just know what it is you really want, and you'll have no problem finding the turn. Once you're sure you've found the revealed road, take a deep breath and turn down onto it. At this point, you have officially started down the nameless road which brings you through 11 miles. 